I'm Jessica Jewell and this is your 10 News Update. Dozens of people are displaced after a fire overnight. Crews say the flames at the Days Inn on Orange Avenue in Roanoke spread into the walls, so several firefighters were brought in to assist with evacuations. We're told one firefighter was taken to the hospital for a minor injury, but otherwise no one was hurt. A man is facing charges after a suspicious death in Campbell County. According to the sheriff's office, Jonathan A. Skew was arrested Saturday for second degree murder after a woman's body was discovered during a house fire on Wards Road Friday. The remains have been identified as his girlfriend, 38 year old Laura Allen. More charges are pending. New COVID-19 restrictions won't impact capacity at restaurants, though the biggest change is the 10 p.m. curfew on alcohol sales. Hotels and event venues will likely take a big hit due to social gatherings being limited to just 25 people. Gyms can also continue to operate at 75 percent capacity. Schools and places of worship are largely unaffected. President Trump's refusal to concede the presidential election has led to nationwide protest. Supporters claim the election is being stolen, despite top officials declaring it the most secure in history. Meanwhile, Biden's team is moving forward with the transition process. Remember, you can always get updates on WSLS.com and the 10 News app. I'm Jessica Jewell, 10 News, working for you.